Hi, so I just went on a beauty haul. I bought all these items yesterday and I kind of want to talk about what are the items, have I used them before and you know just give my review and I'll give you guys an update and if you have any specific questions let me know about this. So um, the first one I'm going to say is um, I got the Eben 24 hour edge tamer. This is for my edges. This is like really good stuff and it's like you know reasonably, reasonably priced. Um, I really think that's like the best edge control. Um, I just got these little duck bill clips here. And I like these for when I wrap my hair at night. And then also when I'm straightening my hair, those help a lot once I have to put like in sections. I have a lot of hair. Um, I have this foundation here. This is a really great foundation. It's Too Faced. I am the color Spice Rum. Born this way. I just love this foundation. It's really good. It is oil-free foundation. It's infused with coconut water. And this is really just a really great foundation. All of that. Cute bottle, too. So this is what it looks like. Here. It comes out but this Too Faced foundation I really like I use that foundation okay next I got is this Morphe you know Morphe is a up-and-coming brand It's definitely up um, it is based out of California and this is they're known for their brushes their eyeshadow and their settings their setting spray like this setting spray is the best like it looks so good and basically what this is is once you put your makeup on when you're finished you uh, you just take this top off here and you just mist your whole face up so this is like really good keep your makeup on all day and it just looks so great so once you spray it after you do your makeup so definitely get you some morphe um i bought this one um this is a, a cheaper if you can't get morphe get this one the matte finish they also have the dewy one too but the holy grail of this finishing spray is this morphe get that brand um next i got was this daily oil moisturizer i noticed my hair was getting like kind of dry and now i'm trying to put like you know more moisture on it uh without my, like weighing it down i've never used this product up before has anyone ever used this product um it's Cantu. I've used Cantu other products and they're pretty good. Um, but I thought this would be interesting to try out. I'm just looking at their ingredients right now. So I don't know. I I'll I'll let you know. I basically just got this to like help because I'm putting a lot of heat on my hair lately and I needed that oil and it's hot outside. So one another thing I got here was this anti-fade cream. And basically this is just a cream you put on your face at night. Like if you have some marks on your face. Um, so, you know, it fades those marks like any um, maybe stretch marks, anything. But Andy's a good product. They also have like a, the soap and the face wash which I bought here. This is the exfoliating wash, face wash, and it's for acne too, so, um, but it's not harsh. It has oat and seaweed, and this is like really good. I've used this before. Really, really good. It has like a little bit of acid on there, so good to go. So that's pretty much what I was using there. Um, alongside with that, I'm going to start using this soap again. I haven't used this soap in forever. This is the Nubian Heritage raw shea butter soap this is good and it just smells so amazing like it smells like a hug i don't know um, it has shea butter cocoa um seed butter coconut oil soy milk palm oil mm -hmm. cruelty free and it's, it's just really good um so i bought that another thing i bought um was this cantu tea tree and um java oil hair and scalp oil so um, this is just when I get braids or something like that, or if I get like a sew-in or whatever, or just I just moisturize my scalp. This is a really good nozzle to use for this. 
and it's not heavy it's, it's light so it doesn't drip and it's you know really good i'm actually going to put some peppermint oil in here because i want something to really stimulate my scalp so i haven't i think i've used this once or something similar to this but this will be really good alongside with that i got this um i've never used this before but in hindsight it sounds like a good idea so i decided to try it and i love this this shea moisture right here shout out to this this shea moisture jamaican black castor oil that whole line is like freaking amazing like the best shampoo the best conditioner best everything like something about that jamaican black castor oil is just amazing if it has jamaican castor oil it's a good product like straight up um, but this also has shea butter which is good and peppermint so um i just got this anti-breakage spray here and basically on the back you're gonna spray on damp hair so basically i'm just gonna spray this on my hair before i blow dry it so this just is really good for the anti-breakage you know it has it's gonna condition my scalp it has that jamaican cast oil remember because i said i want to have more of a um moisture to my hair nutrition and then it has peppermint i love peppermint it's very stimulating peppermint oil also um, promotes hair growth um, so really good ingredients if you can see like sweet almonds you know rice proteins and it's organic too as well so mm, 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 mm. so i got this mask here it's very plain just a little mask as you see here i'm gonna try to bedazzle i've never bedazzled anything in my life so i'm going to try to do a bedazzle for that that's gonna be a little project and then the last thing i got was just a straightening comb this is an electric one so usually people get you know the one on the stove but you know i like this one because you know i'm traveling and it's just less of a hassle so i just got the plug-in one but this is good you know f for um wigs or like just straightening your hair you know um yeah so so this is my beauty haul everything i got here leave a comment if you use any of these products or if you have any question about anything here, just let me know.